No, it was a great experience, you know, and I think um, I think the AD Josh Hurd and his his uh, committee, the voting committee, for giving me the opportunity to just test the waters. I, I think they've been pushing me a little bit down at the university, but um, you know, as of right now, I enjoy my player development role, and I thought that me turning that opportunity down would have, you know, made the guys sort of mad at me. So I took the opportunity to do it. Uh, but I, I've always felt as if the coaches that were on the staff, they were super qualified to act as a term head coach for our program once Coach Satterfield stepped down. Um, but that wasn't the direction that Josh Hurd and the university was going in. So me having the opportunity, I loved it. I loved every second of it. I'm I'm with those young men. I deal with them on a daily basis. Um, that was pretty cool. As far as me coaching, I can see it maybe happening down the line. You know, it, it, it could be there. You know, I, I sit back and I watch some of my peers who are going off and getting these head coaching jobs and, and doing amazing things in college and in the NFL. Um, it, it's a beautiful thing. You know, it's a beautiful thing for us to have the opportunity to give back to a program or to give back to these young men. And I think that's what it's all about. And not only get to coach, you got to coach in, in your backyard where you spent most of your career at Fenway. That pretty I, I, cool. I, I, the, the writing was on the wall. You know, I, I honestly didn't have a choice, to be honest. That's pretty <laughs> much exactly what Josh Hurd told me. Like, Dylan, really, you don't have a choice. You can't say no. You know, and at first I did. I told him I can't do that because I I feel that we had nine, ten other coaches that were super qualified for the role. But I also understood what um what it truly meant. You know, having the opportunity. We're going to play in the Fenway Bowl. It's back in Boston. This is your university for you to be the interim head coach. You know, the writing was on the wall. The only thing that was left is winning the game. And like I told the guys before we left, the game is all already won. It's just all about what's the score is going to be. You know, what are you guys going to do? I'm not doing anything. I'm just actually leading you guys there. You got to win the game. The players make the plays. The coaches don't do much. We just give them the program. We guide them and let the guys play the game of football.